What's going on, Jim? Welcome back to Dark Chronicle again. Me, the Lonesome Ravener. Guys and gals, I'm continuing pretty much where we were before, and we're going to basically just continue on to kind of just finish up the entirety of Sindane, really. Uh, so, our final little task is to get young... Melaine, okay, Melaine. So I think last time in the uh, previous episode we actually kind of figured out slightly that she might be the person who was in the... Oh, actually, no. Oh, actually, one thing we do need to do, actually, before we do that, is we do need to make a straw house. A straw? A house made of straw? What kind of house is this? Uh, beautiful. I actually do that now. That sounds absolutely fantastic. Fantastic. Okay, um, straw house. Place that bad boy down. Because uh, we actually do have... Yeah, we've got three. So we've got three normal houses and we've got one straw house. Two. Okay, so, um, yeah, so basically we apparently uh, need, uh, the girl from Malane, and I'm pretty certain, I'm not 100% certain, but I'm like, you know, like 80% certain that probably she's the girl who's, who works inside of the, um, weapon store. So, we may as well go have a gander and see if we can talk to her for a second and be like, yo, woman, come with us, we need to go to the, to, to Sindane and put you on a train and stuff, and I don't know. Anyway, alright, uh, boo 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 oh, sorry, I apologize for that, my, uh, my phone binging off again there. Alright, um... Hello, Mr. Man. Let's just pop into the weapon store at midnight. The lady's like, I've never slept in my entire life. Save me. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'd be surprised if you're not Malayne. I'd be surprised. I'd be pretty amazed. Uh, be my friend. Um, so you saw me at the circus. Pretty cool, right? It's not, it's not much, so much a job uh, as a hobby of mine. Oh. Hello. Are you not Malayne? Uh, I don't really want to buy anything right now. <laughs> Sorry, love. Uh, are you... Yeah, you are, my love. What is, what is this? What is this? I like you just sheath a blade as well. Like, hey, look at this. Look at my blade. Uh, so you saw me in the circus. Pretty cool, right? Uh, it's not so much a job as a hobby of mine. So what can I... How, how do I... Okay, so... Do I need to go to the circus? Or can I just not get Malayne yet? Is that, is that, is that a thing? Do I, do I, oh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, no, 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 Okay, so, um, the circus, I remember rightly, was more, not that direction, it was more this direction, wasn't it? Yeah, it was this way to the right, wasn't it, for you or something like that? And then, like, we came this direction to get to the, the sewer pipe thing, I think that's how it works. Anyway, I kind of slightly remember that anyway. Anyway, let's have a little gander. Let's have a wee gander and have a look around. All right. See, I don't know if this will actually work. I'm assuming this might be where we have to go to the circus, ask someone, and then... Actually, well, it actually, did it actually give us quests? Did it actually physically give us a quest then, or did it not? Um, let's have a look. Let's have a, let's have a gander. Why not? Let's have a, let's have a wee gander. So, um... Pants... Oh, uh, uh, that's cool. Uh... Um... Huh. Well, let's, we'll, we'll go. We'll go to the circus. See if we actually can do it. I mean, if, 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 if apparently we can't do it right now, then we can't do it now. But I can imagine. I just feel like we should be able to. But and the circus is gone. Yeah, because I'm, I'm. Oh, I'm pretty certain the circus was here. So uh, I'm so confused. I don't understand. Does, does it mean we have to get a clown or something like that first? I don't know. Anyway, all right, fine. Tell you what. What we're gonna do is we're gonna mosey back on over to Sindane Station. And we will probably... Is there anything else we really need to do? I'm going to say no, question mark? Yeah, I think we should be alright. We should be... Cause I imagine this episode now, from now on, is going to be like a fucking hell of a... Ooh. Ah, I was going to say, I was like, I was like, what? What's going on? Okay, uh, so who do we talk to now? You want to leave? Um, yeah, sure, why not? <gasps> ah, fuck it, it's fine. Alright, that's, that's, that's cool. <laughs> alright, let's move them out. I was thinking we might want to go to the uh, the other section of the the dungeon first. I apologize for any background noise, but um, yeah, I, I might want to go to the other dungeon first. But fuck it, we'll be fine. I mean, we might we might come back. We might not. I, I don't really know. So I mean, maybe it's like when we've actually completed the place, we'll then get a key to go to the bonus area. I don't really know. Anyway, all right, to Balance Valley. It's very impressive. These these trains all go to the well. This one train track actually goes to the correct places all the time. It's pretty good. Ready for some exposition, guys and gals. Fucking hell, storming around the corner. Chugga 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 chugga. Wow, they even have a station here. Yeah, impresses me too, pal. This is Balance Valley Station. No, really? <sighs> By the look of things, this valley's been hit as well. 
Hey, Max. We'll take care of things at this end. You take as long as you need. Thanks, Borneo. Go get them, kids. Be careful out there. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Wait, so has there been another cave-in? Seriously, there's been another one? Oh, come on, game! Be a bit more creative than that. It's like, oh no, there's more rocks in the way now. Like, how, it, apparently last time they just managed to finish it just before I fucking got out of the way. It's like, three rocks in the way that time. You'd be like, done. You know, you'd be out of the way. But I guess as we do have to go here, it makes a bit more sense. But come on. Anyway, all right, so. Ooh, awesome. Very nice. Do I need a... I do. Ooh, a clock is on one of my things, so... I can imagine I might need that at one point. Apparently that is not a clock. Uh, oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> uh, I didn't want to move. Go back. Go on to my ick. Too many M's. Too many M's in the way. I can't, I can't figure out, man. Okay. Um, so if we delete useless photos. Yes, please. Do, 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 do. Can, I, can I not? Is that not? Oh, you know what? No, it's okay. I'll accept it. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Alright, uh, no, not just yet. Let me just have a quick hand around here quickly. Um, Han. Han Yards? Han Yards? Han Yards! Alright, uh, okay. Sure. To Balance Valley. Okay, let's see exactly what this place has to offer then. I don't really, I don't really know. I'm kind of, I'm kind of a little confused. I expect them to be a bit more like, hey, we're here for so and so reason. But I know we're getting that dude we were talking about before, but I've kind of forgotten what his name was again. <laughs> oh well. So this is Balance Valley. It is indeed. That's right. There are four plateaus in this valley, but the height of those plateaus can change. Pretty strange, huh? That's her. I love, I love, I love gatos. <laughs> wow. Huh? There are houses over there. <laughs> huh? Might be people as well. Let's go check it out. Huh? There's house over there, just like there was in the previous place. Okay, I, I, I have to admit, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna take a time to kind of just say this now before I completely forget to mention it. Um, I do really like how um, straight away off the bat, we're actually straight away getting like an essence of what we had before, um, back in the previous um, Dark Cloud game. Obviously, I, this isn't really a good thing, but it's kind of like a, a an entertaining thing for myself, I suppose. Um, where basically, like, in every single place, it seems the same kind of things happen every single time. There's one house, there's enemies, there's a dungeon, you gotta do something in there, gotta fix the place. I know that's a kind of like, that's a lot of like that's a standard gener generic stereotype in like, most video games but like I do love how like in this one like in, in, in Dugga 2 just like it does in the sense of Dugga 1 it's like there's one house left one main character well except for maybe like in the fur bits there's more than one but I just find it quite funny it's, it's, it's entertaining you know I, I like it at the same time I really do enjoy the fact that it does, it does kind of keep that trait coming along anyway <gasps> and an, it's an owl seriously it's an owl they just play this. I feel like I just played the first one. Was like, hey, we'll just make a new game exactly the same. Get out. You, you can talk. Hold on, Mr. Owl. Just listen to us, please. What is it? We're looking for somebody. His name is Crest. Do you know him? Crest. So you've come to see Crest, have you? <gasps> dun dun dun! Yes, that's right. Crest is dead. Oh Jesus, okay. Dead? Oh no! So Griffin's henchmen got him too. Now what are we gonna do? And who's this? <laughs> and who's this pretty little thing? He was Crest's apprentice. She's been bedridden with shock ever since his death. Bedridden with shock. Unfortunately, it looks like <laughs> I quite like that. This has taken a turn for the worse. Oh, okay. <laughs> bedridden with shock, like <gasps> I need to go let down. <laughs> Man. Whoa, okay. I kind of want to find out what's going on underneath them sheets. Damn, son. It looks pretty bad. We need a house call from Dr. Dell. Dr. Dell? He's the head doctor in Palm Brinks. The best doctor around. Uh, but he looks like a duck, so don't be too surprised when you see him. You know a doctor? Yep. Looks like Lynn can't be moved, so we'll get the doc to come out here. 
Monica, let's get back to Palm Brink. Yeah, I guess we'd better. Please do hurry back. Right. So, how, so, so, so this girl's been in, like, a comatose state for, like, I don't know how long, and the owl's just sat here like, oh, no, if only there was something I could do. And he's like, you know a doctor? Not a doctor. Fountain, waterfall, and bottle. Okay, that's quite interesting. That should, that should be quite an easy one, but, okay. Uh, to do, oh, not a, okay. I thought my capture failed again then. I was like, no. All right, so, uh, waterfall, waterfall, and a bottle. All right, get those bad boys on there. There we go. Got four of those bad boys. Family, waterfall, and bottle. Okay, sweet. So, uh, thank you very much, Mr. Max. A search idea. Let's quickly go. So, it was Dr. Dell. Okay, sweet. So, um, now I feel like I've met Dr. Dell before, but I'm actually not 100% sure where he is. So, okay. That's fine. That's fine. We're sorted out. Okay. <laughs> we got teleported. What is going on? Okay, let's uh, move, move ourselves out. Boop, 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 boop. Back to Palm Bricks. The Parmesan Brinks. I like, I like, we are literally going back to Palm Brinks every fucking two seconds. It's like, you know what? Maybe we need to bring, I think we just need to bring the town with us. Like, literally the entire town. Um, okay, so we need, we need the, we need Dr. Dell. Um. Okay, so. I, I, I really like this game. I, don't get me wrong. I really, 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 really like this game. But they just seem quite vague on where you're meant to go. I understand for you guys and gals which you may have played this game maybe a couple times or like um, at least maybe once. Um, but like I've, I've never played this game before. Like so I mean I, I, I'm entirely new to what this game can throw at me. And it just keeps sort of saying hey you know there's, there's things around about the place you should go to and you should know about and stuff. And you should find them. I'm not going to tell you where they are, but you should. I, I mean, at the same time, I don't want them to hold my hand. Like, say for example, like, um, like when they did the uh, with, the, with, the, with the rainbow thing with I like how it eventually said it was like, well, red goes first, son. Red goes first. I, I did quite like that. Eventually, it was all like, it, I, I, I liked it, but I didn't like it at the same time because I thought it was quite. Not all games. A lot of games do quite go quite easy on you stuff like that. And honestly, this has gone like a bit too far. It's a bit too disconnected. If that makes sense, it'd be a bit of a hit. It'd be better if like one of the characters like, hey, you know, doctors this direction. Um, Wait, have I actually, have I got it here in the first try? Hey, don't you think Morton from the item shop needs, uh, <laughs> oh, um, hey, don't you think Morton from the item shop kisses up to uh, Mayor Mead? Uh, do we know each other? <laughs> Why have you told me this? Okay, uh, do, do, okay, yep, okay, sweet. Okay, so apparently, am I am I in the hospital or something like that? Uh, that deer in the Mayor's office, you, you, um, your dad gave it to him a long time ago, didn't he? Sure. Am I am I at the doctor's place? I, I don't know. I just sort of randomly came because like a huge big building and I hadn't really ever come this direction before, so I thought I'd give it a try. Um, with a camera, you can photograph photograph the sun and moon and sunrises and sunsets too. Oh my gosh! All right. Uh, do do do. I mean, I, I would love to. So I'd love to do that. But half the time, it's like all the buildings are all in the direction the uh, which the sun's coming from. So it's a bit of a hard thing to do. I don't know, Mister Mayor needs. Grumble, grumble, grumble. What do you mean, what am I muttering about? I'm trying to remember the combination for the safe. What do you mean, what safe? The safe hidden beneath, uh, behind the picture in my, in my office, of course. Uh, ah, you gave me a fright. Oh, Plast. I've gotta let out my biggest secrets. Oh, well, you know now. Um, Ming, give me a hand trying to work it out. Um, I've got a big problem because I can't remember the combination for my safe. Um, it's a four-digit number. Might need to write this down. Um, so I use Claire's birth date thinking that I'd never forget. Seriously? Um, okay. Uh, how could I possibly forget what a terrible father I am? It looks like the mayor's, uh, very troubled. Listen to what he says about, uh, about Claire's birthday, uh, and figure out the combination. So, um, a long time ago, I gave her a, uh, a brooch? A brooch? I think I was to say a brooch. A brooch! I gave her a brooch! I gave her a good old brooch on it. Oh, yes. That's a bit weird thing for a, a father to say about us doing about. Well, okay. Uh, with her star sign on it. Um, Holly sorted it out for me, so I don't really remember, but I'm sure it's a four-legged animal. Okay. Uh, does that mean four? Okay, four. What kind of birthday presents have I given her? Hmm, lots of coats and scarves. I oh, it's just, it, was, it was winter. I never know uh, what to get her. It's a real struggle every year. Oh yes, Claire's birthday is always a right pain. It's on the, it's a, it's what? It's on a day when both burnable and non-burnable garbage get collected. What is this? 
Okay, so... Uh, hang on, hang on, so... Uh, animal... Cold... Garbage... Uh, both... Day... Jesus Christ, okay. Um... Uh, non burnable garbage gets collected on days visible by seven. Divisible... Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, non... Non burn... Seven. Divisible by seven. And burnable garbage gets collected on days divisible by three. My god, what... Why, why did they just... Why did they just say, hey, it's on this date and this date? You wouldn't forget that, though, would you? Uh... I get it! Mystery solved! Is it? I get it, mystery solved. Uh, the combination is... Uh, I get it, mystery solved. Um... Have I? <laughs> have I got that? Do I know it? Uh, okay, so... I think... As it's American, they'll probably do the month first. So I'm probably gonna say as it's like, it's winter. I'm gonna say it's 12. And I'm gonna say it's classic December, because it's always a pain to buy for. But apparently the date... I'm gonna say so it has to be a number... Divisible by 7. And divisible by three, so twenty-one. So would that be one, two, two, one? Yes! Oh, Bobowski! Oh, I am a genius! I am so. That was. Ah. Oh. Oh my, that was beautiful! Damn son! Great, now I can get my important documents out. Fucking, way to go champ. Okay, oh, thank you. What important documents? Uh, documents that will help uh, Vice Mayor Morton uh, do my job while I'm away. Uh, it's a bit of a worry, but I'm sure it'll be okay. Uh, right, now I'm all set uh, to, uh, to leave town now uh, too. Cedric told me everything. Come on, let's go. May I need join your party? Oh my bloody god, I am just too good sometimes. I'm just too good. Oh yes. Alright, make sure you separate your garbage and throw it out on the right days, won't you? Damn son, that was- I- I didn't even- that was- that was pretty damn genius, that was. I- I mean, I'm not- I'm, I don't mean to float my own boat, but I just accidentally managed to figure that out. That's pretty cool. Alright, um, I'll just drop these down as well. Fountain, window, wooden, box. Oh, I'm so- I'm a little bit proud of myself for that, I have to know. I'm just a little bit proud of myself for that. Okay, uh, oh, number one. Um, post deer horn, uh, okay, so- Post, deer, horn, and work, robot, okay. Post. I actually probably could make that one, to be fair. So, isn't there a deer in here somewhere? Isn't there a deer in here? Oh, yes, there is a deer in here. Oh, there is, yeah. Um, okay. Deer horn, okay. Uh, it was, so, what was it again? It was, it was, uh, post, post, deer horn, and work, robot. Uh, does that mean, like, my work robot? Or does that mean... I don't know. What the hell is that? <laughs> Sunglass. <laughs> okay, sure, why not? Uh, okay. Alright, thank you, Mr. Mayonnaise. You you have made me feel so much better about myself. Alright. <laughs> I know we were looking for... Um... Wait, what were we doing again? Oh, Dr. Dell. Dr. Dell. <laughs> I was like, I forgot entirely then. I was like, I was like wait, what? Oh, well, alright. Oh, sorry, love. Okay. Um, so, it was uh, post... Deer horn and work rope. I tell you, I, I imagine we'll probably go past that way again, hopefully. So we'll have a we'll have a quick gander, see if we can do that. Alright. Okay, sorry, I just readjusted myself. The apologize for me is crackling on my chair. I, I need a new chair because it like just cr it creaks all the time. At the same time, it's like I like my chair. My chair's pretty good. Alright, uh so. Um boo -ba -da -boo, -ba -da boo Okay, I guess we'll just keep one around, see if we find Dr. Dell. I like how as soon as we went in there, that one woman was like, Hey, I spoke to Dr. Dell. It's like, you jammy bastard. I know you had to tease me about it, but come on. Alright, so I'm, I'm assuming we just can't still go into any of these, right? Okay, that's cool. Okay, sorry. A little bit of a sniffle there. I do apologize, guys. Okay, so, um, sweet. Show. Where do we go? Where do we go now? Where do we go? Hmm. Hmm, uh, do you know where Dr. Dell is? Hey there, Max, come, uh, mm, I'm not sure I'm up to it, sorry, pal. Uh, the only reason I don't want to do that is because I don't have any idea where the fucking boat is. It's like, hey, you should go to the boat to this location, because, you know, uh, I don't know. Anyway, alright, so, um, 
Okay, so you're there. So is, this a, is this a library or a police station? I just feel this is a, like some kind of library to be fair. So like you go in and it's like, I'll read this sign. I'll read this sign. I'll read this sign. It's like, hey, um. No, nothing else really, to be fair. Uh, just between us, I don't really think this uh, town needs two or three cops running around. I have so much time. I just eat and eat. Damn son. Tough life you live, pal. Um, Sheriff Blinkholm is pretty strict. Uh, he's kind enough to the townsfolk, but when it comes to his job, Dun dun dun! All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay, come on, Maxi boy. So, uh, I kind of doubt it's this direction to be fair, because I mean, the station's there. There's not really too much else, if I remember rightly. Uh, there's the bar. There's the coffee shop. I think that's really about it. I think yeah. I don't think I can't imagine there'll be the station. I mean, it might be, but I doubt it. To be fair, but we'll find out. Uh, okay, so I'm trying to think. Um, so of course we have. We need a post, don't we? So a post and a work robot. A work robot. Oh my gosh, a work robot. All right, let's go on here. It's clever! It has a door shaped like a keyhole! Oh my gosh! <laughs> Alright, uh, is that class of work robot? Oh, old style robot. Okay, okay. Um, work robot, work robot, work robot. Okay. Uh, ooh, can we can we take a picture of the hoof thing? Vacuum! Yay! What a, what a boss. Okay. Um, work robot, work robot, work robot. I mean, it makes sense to kind of be like work as in like, you know, work robot but not not literally telling a robot to work but it might, it might be you never know um okay that's not too bad it's all right it's not like a desperation for me to get it i was just kind of curious to see if there's anything else uh, anything i can actually do with it um that's, that's a really inefficient tool that is it's like a huge spiky handle and then a huge mallet on the other end like i'm not too sure it's gonna really come in too much in handy um okay let's have a gander uh what even is this? Vacuum, vacuum bag? That's a vacuum bag? Okay, sure, why not? I'll accept that. All right, let's actually see if I can actually uh, like invent something just using these. So, um, new invention. I want to go for a post. Uh, make seed. Uh, I want to go for a. Um, a deer horn. And I want to go for the. Uh, Old style robot. I want to see. I want to see if this works just by like seeing if it's like just slightly wrong. See if it actually works. But okay, that's cool. <gasps> oh, no good. You're huh? so close. You have to think of something big. M. Ooh, post something old. St Ooh, okay. That's actually quite interesting. Okay, so post an old style robot plus something beginning with M. Okay. Uh, post question mark and old robo. Okay, sweet. That's actually pretty really badass. That is okay. Um. Wait, is that is that the thing that they suggest here? Uh, construct a cloth ladder. I'm not gonna worry about that one too much. Okay, that's that's actually pretty cool. Okay, M M. I'm gonna suppress the moon. I imagine just because it starts with an M. It's the first thing I can think of. But um, actually, oh, actually, do I have uh, just to give it a try? So um, so old star robot makes seed of invention. Um, posts make that as well. So begin with M. Master Utan. Um. Give it a go, <laughs> see if it works. I doubt it to be fair, but yeah, I thought so. That's, that's cool. That's cool. Oh, no good, okay, huh? something soon. Idea M. Okay, wait, is it, is it the idea itself, which is? Hang on, if I just okay, that's cool. Um, wait, so is it? Mm, I doubt because it's just the. Um, it might, it might be. You never know. We'll, we'll give it a go. Why not? So, is it the actual idea itself that starts with like an M? You'll think of something soon. Idea. Also, oh, the idea itself starts with an M. Okay. Uh. I, I don't know. Um. Milk can maybe. I mean, that starts with an M. That might generally actually be it. Ah, damn. Okay. <laughs> that's fine. All right. That's cool. I'm not. I'm, I'm, I'm not fussed. Okay. Back we go. Back we go. Okay. It all seems like it all seems like just very confusing that kind of stuff because like. It seems there's a lot to it when you don't actually really need that much to it, but I mean, in all fairness, it gives a lot of different stuff, a lot of different experiences and stuff, so that's, that's fair, it's fair. Okay, so we are going to find Dr. Dell before this episode's up, so uh, let's mosey on through. Um, I'm trying to think where Dr. Dell will even be. Um, I mean, so we know the priest's over there. We've explored this area to the left, so right here, I absolutely shit, I'm going to like barely anyone. 
So I'm guessing maybe this direction then. I mean, it would kind of make sense, especially this. Can I? What the hell's going on with the camera? Okay, sure. I, I'm loving not seeing in front of me. Can I? Okay. <laughs> this is where Max dies. Uh, okay. What is this? Okay, this is quite cool. Alright. My- why wasn't- why wasn't the- I'm guessing it's just, uh, I'm guessing the game was just loading, is that why? I'm guessing it's just like, you're not allowed to see the game loading! No, 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 come on! Uh, what's this? Okay. Okay, does that mean we're like, eventually at one point we're gonna like, just randomly crash into the town? Um... Oh, is this- oh, is this the place? Uh, why do all men like to fish, I wonder? That's a good question, I've never fished myself, so I actually don't know. Uh, hello, love. I saw some dwarfs with big ears around here. Then again, maybe it was just my imagination. I think you've been blazing up a bit too much, love. Alright, uh, it's the Thurbits! Oh my gosh! Uh, <laughs> is that like a doctor symbol? Looks. That kind of looks like a doc, doctor guy. Dr. Bill looks like. Doesn't look like a, a, a human as well. It's more like a seahorse, to be fair. But. Let's find out! Da, 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 da. Oh, hello! Hey! Well, if it isn't Max, what's up? Oh my god, I love his voice. Well, if this isn't Max, what's up, Please, man? Dr. Dell, come with us. A really sick girl needs your help. Okay, I didn't hear that at all then. That's cool, that's cool. I was kind of waiting for the audience to come in. I was like, okay, Dr. Jell has joined- Dr. Dr. Jell. Dr. Jell has joined you. Dum 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 Hello. Oh, <gasps> it's the it's the bunny guys. Yeah, I don't mind growing. Uh, yeah, I don't mind going with you. But uh, will there be a moon there? Uh, really? Uh, maybe you're just saying that. I, I know humans tell lies. Um, actually, I've changed my mind. I'm gonna wait uh, for the moon to come out here. Uh, maybe it's something. Uh, what is? Okay, maybe it's because something's uh, because of something that's happened in the past. But Rufio doesn't trust humans at all. Um, you, you, uh, you've got- <laughs> I'm sorry, my speech is just terrible there, I'm like, oh, oh, oh. Um, you've got to get a review to believe you. If you get- if you gave him a photo of the moon, that might do it. I actually only have have him. Uh, wow, amazing, there's a moon in this photo! Now I can see the moon anytime, any place. Come with you? Of course, I will. Um, of course I will. I've got- <laughs> I've got nowhere else to go. That's really depressing. Okay, thanks, Rufio, you're a- So are you a bunny guy like before? That's kind of like oh, 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 ominously scary, but okay. That's pretty cool though. I mean, so I'm guessing here's one of like the rabbit people from before. That's pretty beast, pretty beasty. Okay, um, sweep. So let's uh, mosey back on over to Fingmiju. Back to good old Balance Valley. Good old Balance Valley. Why not? <laughs> Uh, I'm so, I'm really sorry, guys and guys. My speech is just terrible there. I'm I, I'm trying my best. I'm trying to speak. I'm trying to be nice. I'm trying to be like talkative and stuff. But I'm just like, oh, la, 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 half time. Anyway, I tell you what, guys and guys. I'm actually gonna save this this uh, next part for um, the next episode. I'm gonna sort of like just leave it for now. For this episode's gonna be a little bit long. Um. So yes, thank you guys so much for watching. It's been another episode of Dark Chronicle. Um. Again, I'm so sorry for like my just weird behavior recently. I've, I've been I'm sort of just like quite burnt out at the moment. I'll probably do the next episode. I might just stop for now because it's been a fair little uh, trek of uh, recording for a bit. Now, so yeah, um, but yes, thanks so much for watching, guys and gals. Uh, it's, this has been Dark Chronicle. I've lost my avatar, and you guys have been absolutely beautiful and amazing as ever. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode. Like, once again, ladies and gentlemen, you guys have been beautiful once again. I've lost my avatar, and once again, this has been Dark Chronicle. So, c'est la vie, hasta vista, and goodbye. Watch out!